Hi, I'm Anjee Singh, founder of Mandeeps.com and in this video, we'll set up a sample site by importing one of Mandeep's DNN themes. So let's get started. What I have here is a installation of DNN 9.1. It's important to note that this procedure or in this video only applies to DNN 9.1 or greater. L look at our uh, portal template videos if you're running uh, previous versions of DNN. Okay, so one of the first things we want to do is locate the export import folder, uh, which has the files that we need to import. So after you download the theme, uh, this is one of Mandeep's DNN themes, either from mandeeps.com or DNN store, uh, it would be in a zip file uh, that you would need to extract or unzip. Once you extract or unzip, you will have a bunch of different folders like this. As you can see in this particular video, I'm using the Tahoe theme but this video applies to any of Mandeep's DNN themes. Once you've located the export import folder simply double click on it and inside you'll see a folder uh, that will say sample site. So in per this particular case it says Tahoe sample site. Now normally you would use an uh, FTP client such as file zero or something and simply move this folder over to your uh, DNN site. In my case I have the files locally on the server so I'm just simply going to drag and drop them. Okay so let's go ahead and do that. I'm going to bring my uh, DNN site up into the view and that's right here and we're going to simply drag and drop this folder to app data export import on your site. So I'm just going to simply drag this over here and like I said normally this is done through a, a, a FTP client such as FileZero or any other tool that you're uh, hosting providers has provided you to upload files. Okay, so after we've done that, we're ready to go ahead and set up the uh, sample site. We're simply going to make sure that we're logged in as a host or super user. And then we're going to navigate to uh, manage. Then we're going to go to sites. And I have a, uh, a default installation of DNN here, so I see the default site. I'm just going to simply click on site import here. And now I see that the Tahoe sample site folder that we moved, I see that's available as an option. So I'm going to go ahead and click on it and hit continue. All right, so at this time, we are ready to start the import. I'm going to take just a few minutes to explain what we see here. This, this information is basically telling us that uh, once we're done with the import, it will create 118 different pages for us and uh, it will set up and create add content to those pages for us. We'll set up the correct permissions. It will actually go ahead and install any extensions that are required. We can see specifically there are three of them. So what this really means that you do not need to install the Tahoe theme or the common Mandeep's common library or any other bundle module such as Live Slider. This import process does it all for you. So you can simply just drag that folder and import and you're done with it. You don't have to worry about individual extension installations. That is very neat with DNA 9.1. So that's what it's telling us that there's a bunch of files that it will move and that that's the export size and so forth. So all you have to do is whenever you're ready, hit continue and this will start cranking away. Now this is a scheduled task. Uh, it runs in the background and it can take a few minutes. So. We're going to simply just wait here and see that the, uh, the job has been queued and we now see that it is in progress and I can see it just started importing the pages for me and it's telling me 27 pages has been done. So we're just going to wait for this to go through its uh, its process here. We'll finish with the pages, it'll install the extension, the assets and so forth. And usually it takes a few minutes uh, and it's really going to depend on the uh, hardware configuration of your site and how much resource that it has available. I'm running locally so it's going super fast here and we're almost going to be done here shortly. So we'll just stick around for a few more minutes and let this do its magic. Alright, as we can see the pages are done. Uh, it imported all of them. Uh, it finished with all the assets and it's saying it's even done with uh, the entire site. Now sometimes if it's going to skip extensions that it's making its call it's probably pre-installed or for whatever reason but we're done here and that's that's all we really had to do. Simply go ahead and refresh the page or uh, and you should see all your data come in. 
and there we go I have a beautiful looking sample site ready uh, with all the pages created and all the content available to me now if this is the first time you've done that if you have not installed the theme before or the modules you will be prompted here at this time to activate them uh, simply refer to how to install uh, DNN themes or how to install our DNN modules and that has walk uh, walk through instructions on how to activate the products as well but here we go we have a setup site completed there's one more thing I want to point out really quick here is there is a bug in DNN site import and export that it does not always import all the content now if you run into it for example it only created the portfolio pages or these pages but did not create the home pages or any other page if you think your import is not complete or your demo site sample site does not look like the one that we offer on our site just repeat the process there's no harm simply go back here to uh, sites and just do import and then select it again hit continue and then hit continue again you can go ahead and do that over and over if you want but usually by the second try DNN gets it right and it imports everything for you I was happened to be lucky that everything worked on the first fly and we're done here in this short video but if you have any questions or concerns feel free to open a support ticket and we'll be happy to see you assist you thank you so much for watching this video